I saw a, some private tweets by Matt Drudge, not his Drudge Report account, but his own personal thoughts. I get personal, not private. And, and he implied that if Trump continues, you will see massive, massive street protests. And I think he's right. I think you'll see hundreds of thousands of Mexican illegal immigrants jamming the streets of L.A. and, and other cities and in Texas, too. I think what you saw in Chicago, multiply it by 10. You'll see it in St. Louis, in Baltimore, in Washington, D.C., in all the cities that these street groups are active because they know if Trump becomes the nominee and if Trump wins, their eight-year street rule of terror, and it's more than eight years, 30 years, is over because you finally got a conservative who's willing to punch back Chicago style. I think that this is really the last key moment for conservatives and severely normal Americans to say, we do not want to give a heckler's veto to these violent groups. And if Donald Trump is stopped by a brick or a bullet, I think America is lost because any of the other Republicans, you can see they're, they're blaming the victim for the riots here. Am I overstating things? I think Trump will no, crystallize I, I think the fight. You're definitely saying something that resonates with a lot of people. I mean, you might not like Donald Trump, but if he is the representative of freedom of speech and everybody else, including the Republicans, are against it, you know, you've got to stand with him. I mean, I feel quite undecided about this election personally. You know, I go through days where I like different candidates, but certainly seeing Donald Trump on the receiving end of this makes me more inclined to support him uh, than I might have been otherwise because you have to stand with freedom. Thanks for watching. Click here to never miss a Rebel update. Want even more of the Rebel? Well, click here to become a premium member.